What's up guys? We're on our way to the gym. How far is this gym? Like 20, 20 minutes? Huh? How far away is the gym? It be Anyways, we're meeting up with one of my friends, Christian De Silva. Huh? What did you say? Talking to the YouTube channel. I do not talk. Oh. So we're meeting up with uh, Christian De Silva, kid I knew from school. He has a huge beard. He does? Yeah, it's like... It's <laughs> nice. It's like a lumberjack. You don't have that? No, I, my job makes me shave it. What does he do? I think he's a personal trainer. It's raining again. This is the rainy season. Yeah. July. We've had what? This is the third cloudy day in a row. July, August, and September. You don't want to be in Florida. <laughs> Hopefully we'll get some nice weather soon. Gotta get a tan. Tomorrow's supposed to be nice. Yeah. Then we'll go down and see us the key, the beach. See us the key, yeah. Oh, is that the, it's not white sand beaches, is it? Yes. Cool. It's huge. It's wide, it's so wide. And you gotta walk for like almost half a mile before you get to the water. <laughs> Oh, well, not half a mile, that's exaggerating. Probably <laughs> a quarter of a mile. Yeah. It's a, it's a good distance. But it's wide, so it is. Even when it's a lot of people, we still fit a lot of people. Yeah. Which one is Pizza House there over here? Uh, this one right here. Okay. Right there. That's yeah. What is up, family? So I haven't done a commentary in a while, so I figured I would do it for this collab. So, uh, in this video, you'll see my boy Christian. Uh, I know Christian from a long way back. Uh, we went to middle school together, actually, and then he moved down to Bradenton, Florida, right near Sarasota, after sixth grade. So, I happen to be in the area on vacation, and I hit him up, and he happens to do his own fitness YouTube channel, too. So I figured we would do a collab. So if you guys want to go check him out, he can be found on YouTube at Christian De Silva Fitness. Check his stuff out. He's had a crazy eight-month transformation where he's put went from 130 pounds to I think currently he's 190 pounds. So crazy transformation. Um, and today we just did uh, an all upper body workout. Originally planned to do legs, but wanted to do the same thing. So. We're hitting upper body, chest, back, triceps, shoulders, biceps, all of it. And this is just some raw footage. I'll let you guys see me in the next video. I'm doing 225 for about four ish reps. Yeah. Usually, like during the end, I'll do terrible. Like, I'm not hit, I'll bend down. I've already started. <laughs> I got candy corn at Walmart. Because <laughs> they, they never have gluten free candy corn. I'm gluten free, right? They had it, so I was like, yeah, man. And I was, I was doing it. So I was having the serving size to bring it down. And then it just, if I have the whole bag, <laughs> then I'm like, no, I'm gonna screw it tomorrow, so I'm just gonna eat it all tonight. <laughs> hey, you ready? So I was actually super proud of that 225 bench because as I told you guys before, I have shoulder problems and I also tweaked my shoulder towards the end of my bulk 
so I lost the majority of my strength. So to be able to push 225 for about four times on a cut felt amazing. So in this video, we did pull-ups till failure, supersetted with about eight to ten barbell rows. This machine was by far my favorite I've ever used. So it's a Smith machine, but it has the ability to be pulled out and used as a regular barbell row. And I thought it was just the coolest thing. I was, I was totally blown away. It was awesome. Um, so then you'll see Christian here. The beast. Christian banging out about 10 to 12 pull-ups um, in the audio before, before I took it out. I was just telling him to focus on squeezing his back because... When when you tend to be without a lifting partner, when you when you tend to be bulking, especially you're more focused on on doing more weight or whatnot. So really, what it's all about is that mind and muscle. So you need to be able to control the heaviest weight, but still squeeze your muscles. So you, I always tell people you can push, pull, whatever way you want, but if you're not squeezing the muscle you're working, it's all a bunch of bullshit. You know, even you're just expending energy. So make sure you're squeezing that muscle. Um, focus on, on that contraction and and push the heaviest weight that you can while controlling it. That's that's pretty much what it comes down to. Um, in the next video, you'll see me doing more pull-ups and whatnot. I'll let the uh, raw footage play so you guys can hear the live commentary. Hey, guys. I shaved my beard. Yeah. <laughs> I, look a little, by Jim I look a little different. <laughs> I'm glad I didn't wear the shirt though. Yeah. Oh, we yeah. would have been twinning. That would have been fine. Dude, that would have been a video. You did a red net video. Can I record? Yeah. I'm 
make sure you switch your grips on each one, bounce your body up. Whew. What are you <laughs> Squeeze it. I gotta charge my shit. There you go, squeeze. Do me a favor, when you're coming down, open your arms up, yeah, and then come up, squeeze. There you go. Oh yeah, I feel that. Yeah. This little body by Ryan, he's Christian De Silva. There you go. Focus on that squeeze. There you go. So what I was doing, it's creating that stretch in your abs on the way back and that contraction you're coming up there you go nice Good.